Sounds like Murder Mom's feeling more stabby than usual. Hey! Better not slice through anything in that cargo bay! We ain't restocking anytime soon! Damn Harsh! Shoo, shoo. Move over. What are you looking at? Oh no. You ain't chewing through any more of my ship. My ship? Shoo! Flark off! Wow. That panel must have looked really tasty. What's it for, anyways? Emergency door controls for the ship. Something a ship owner should know. Hey, do I look like an engineer? You don't! Anything yet? Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo, buddy. Where have you been? We've been calling you. Sorry, Peter Quill. Cosmo's ball has been tied. Universal Church of Truth arrive at nowhere. What? Are you okay? He's fine for a moment. Cosmo receive warning in time. But Continuum Cortex is of shutdown for safety. He's been dead, huh? Your little detective trip almost got us killed. We'll fill you in when we get there. Yet. This problem is bigger than Cosmo. Guardian of Galaxies must go to Xandar and ask World Mind for help instead. Cosmo unable to get through. Guardian of Galaxies must actually. Cosmo, are you there? What happened? I am Groot. are the cowards who defile Lady Hellbender's honor. Oh, good. And who the flock are you? Normally, I would not engage in conversation with inferior life forms. But my contract with Lady Hellbender stipulates otherwise. Therefore, abomination. You may refer to me by my title. I am Captain Glory, leader of the Lethal A uh, lethal legion? Uh, more like loser legion. <laughs> he surrounded us. Listen, I get that Lady Hellbender's super pissed, but now's really not the best time. Did you think that she would ease her bounty simply because you somehow managed to elude the Blood Brothers in nowhere? Yes. Then you were as imbecilic as they are. Lady Hellbender sends her regards, so-called Guardians of the Galaxy. Prepare to be eliminated. No, you prepare to be eliminated. <laughs> Smooth. Uh, we got this. Probably. <sighs> Sense. We just wasted a ton of you. 
Woo! <laughs> Who's the inferior life form now, huh? Drop Still. out and get a better angle if it gets Peter. Smart. I'm picking up something. What? It appears I'll have to finish this myself. So you defeated my fighters. But my cruiser will crush you. That's it? That's what you've been bragging about? What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing. It's... Well, I'm sure it's very comfortable. I will not be mocked! Then do something about it. Lady Skullshoot has the worst block in timing! Is she here? Just her goons! This time! Keep hitting his exhaust ports. Your strategy will work. Thanks. You just confirmed that it will. It's starting to feel like we pissed off the whole galaxy. Moron. Protect our points. This guy's starting to sound like rocket. It's called language efficiency, Quill. are getting paid for killing us. Let me look up the contract real quick. Oh, 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 oh man. These guys are making jump change. Really? Oh. I am Clary, warrior of... <laughs> Take that, Lady Skull Scut. I doubt we've seen the last of her. We won't worry about Lady Hellbender later. Let's just focus on getting to Xandar. Punch it! Yep. Old girl needs a tune-up. We can do it once we reach the station. I ain't letting no bucket head near my... Wow. Talk about cosmic gridlock. I haven't seen this many ships around Xandar since the start of the Galactic War. Open a channel, Groot. Let's see what's going on. These ships come from converted worlds. They're refugees. I need immediate docking permission. Please answer us. Groot, that's enough. I don't see any rescue shuttles coming out. They're ignoring them. No. No, 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 no. Nova Corps might be a bunch of self-righteous domeheads, but they're, they're supposed to be helping folk. That's their whole flarkin' deal. Relax, Rocket. We'll just call the station and ask to speak to the world mind. Groot. Welcome to Novacore Headquarters. Please state your preferred language of communication. I am Groot. I know, bud, but now we can all follow along with Star Pants' mistakes. How, How may we assist you? you? 
Hunter must choose quickly, little one. We should report what Raker is up to. Think the Flarkin world mind doesn't already know? Maybe not oh, every. Flark you! We, we are aware of the current threat, but, but can devote no, no resources toward fighting it. Just pick something, Peter. After scanning your ship, our near-perfect algorithms pre-selected several officer choices. Cadet Nicolette Gold's communication privileges are suspended while we investigate her involvement in unsanctioned cult activity. You should force your spawn to answer us. I can't do that. She's independent. I am Groot. I am Groot. Groot wants you to pick World Mind. Centurion Corel's personal communicator has either been destroyed or disabled and could not be reached. For what it's worth, I'm sorry, Quill. Me too. I am Groot. Groot wants us to report a crime, which is just wrong. Seriously wrong. The allocation of resources for direct communication with us has been denied. We apologize for the inconvenience. Well, it was worth a shot. Let's try something else. Hey, Wallberry, got any ideas? How about future crime? Great idea. Thank, Thank you for being proactive. However, However the, the galaxy's galaxy. impending doom makes, makes all future crimes irrelevant. I we should tell them about the promise. Right, as if none of these other ships ain't already blasting about it all over the comms. Connect. I can't believe that worked. Gardeners of the galaxy. Explain, explain yourselves. Hey, world mine. Long time no see. It's me. Peter Quill, Star Lord. And, uh, it's Guardians of the Galaxy. Check the addendum. We need your help. To pay a fine? No. No, of course not. You need to save the, the galaxy. galaxy. cannot be saved, Peter Quill. What? A mass delusion known as the Promise is sweeping its systems, converting all who encounter it. In less than three cycles, it has spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts, worlds, and systems. Praxis 9, Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda Galaxy, all lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They, actually, the world mine is a collective consciousness. Look, we know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop it. How can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. Told you, they're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of me. And you better not call me in it. Look, we just escaped the church's mothership. We have a ton of intel you can use to bring them down. There is nothing you can tell us we do not already know. Pretty sure I know a few things that even a supercomputer can't know. Such as? Well, how to groom the feathers on a Shi'ar warbird, for starters. Are you still alive? Because I know how to groom the feathers. Yeah, well, I know where you can buy hack Novacore helmets at ridiculously discounted prices. What? They obviously don't know about it, or they do something. Th the point is, we've lived things, experienced things. We've survived the promise, and maybe our experience can be used to help you bring them down. It is possible. We have, have overlooked, overlooked the value of individual experiential memories stored within our files. Good. So let's pull resources. However, given, given the ill-defined parameters of such a query, undertaking a search protocol at this time is ill-advised. Now, if you will excuse us. The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation of Xandarian culture. All else is secondary. <laughs> Have you seen what your planet looks like? Xandarian culture is a lost cause. Culture is more than a location. But you're Nova Corps' leader. You have a duty to protect this galaxy. That, that is incorrect. 
You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads? We do we not have a duty to protect this galaxy. We merely police it to get advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only yourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. We have officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The risk is too great. It would be a pointless sacrifice. For unknown reasons, the church is stockpiling resources. Its influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. Then update your models. We cannot, we cannot adjust our computations to the enemy's nonsensical power source. You mean faith energy? Faith, as an energy source, is illogical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If the power source cannot be quantified, it cannot be countered. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. That is why they fail. Don't you control the Nova Force? The magical energy that powers Nova Core? It... is not magical. But yes. Then how do you explain that one? Because to an outsider, it doesn't seem logical at all. Thanos used to say it was generated by the living computers of Xandar. The living computers of Xandar are the Nova Force. It exists because we exist, and we exist, therefore it does. Sounds like you're able to harness your collective energy just like Raker with other people's faith. Maybe the way you do it can tell you how the Church does. Perhaps. You have given us new data to consider. Guardians of the Galaxy, we will. Later. Right now, we need to focus on our departure. You're still leaving? We did not make this decision without considering all available options. A complete search of our databanks only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what. Who? I am Warlock, the Church's original Golden God. Unfortunately, he perished in the last year of the Galactic War. Great. So, no one? We are, we are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, no Guardians. Guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline's still asking for fine money. <sighs> All right, let's get this over with. Confirm payment. Oh, what? Whole universe is about to end, and you spend our cash on a Novacore fine. Look, dude, the church is about to come for all of us. Once that disabler goes off, we'll be sitting ducks. All right, at least we got that sorted. Let's get out of here. Peter, we've got movement. I'm Groot. They're taking off. Jump, Quill. I know. Petro's promise is becoming real. Peter? Gotta get clear first. Come on. And go! What did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The Loser Legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. Guys, 
It's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Right. And how are we going to do that? We're dead in the flock and water. And right. promise us, we we screwed. freely accepted. Oh, yeah. And without an engine, we're screwed Guys, anyway. guys, guys, guys. Enough. Just stop already. I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagnosis. I don't care! Just fix it! Scoff. And what are we supposed to do? I don't know, okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. Don't. I just... can't do this right now. <sighs> I need some rest. Screw Nova Corps. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. It's our great leader. If you're about to throw another tantrum, do it quietly this time. Really? How did you... Oh, I'm gonna get fleet. Come on, girl. Shoo, shoo. What the f... That's how you got in? smells great What is this? How are you... me? Come on! The talking raccoon's waiting for you! Everybody is! Uh, Rocket, yeah, he was... fixing that thing that broke. Hey, if we're some kind of big space hero now, why are we running from the bad guys? <sighs> it's complicated. No, it's not! Stop running! And we've landed! Uh... <sighs> 
<sighs> Groot wanted to let you sleep. Can you believe it? <sighs> How long was I out? Long enough to fly us all the way to the quarantine zone. Wait, how do we fly out here? Quill, do you want to fix your ship or not? My ship! Yes, your ship. Come on, the others are outside. Whenever you're ready, Quill. Give me a minute. You've had plenty of minutes. Sleeping doesn't count. There, let's go! Look who stumbled out of bed. The rodent made decisions in your sleep. Yeah, yeah, I know. Took you long enough? What? Nikki? I'm not supposed to be here. You promised you would get me out of here. I know, but... <sighs> Nikki! Guys, don't let it get to you! Won't have to tell me twice! Drax, you're kind of freaking me out, man. I had to share the good news, Peter Quill. You have lost your family. Your mother. The Kree woman. You understand the pain that comes from loss. Drax. But with faith, with the Matriarch's promise, our families can be restored. I... I Drax, I don't... You have accepted her promise, have you not, Peter Quill? Uh, not exactly, but, but, but not because I don't want to. It's just, I have questions. I understand. The Matriarch's promise is overwhelming. Overwhelming is a word for it. It also took me time to see the miracle of her promise. Yes, yes, uh, time. I just need... Time. I will give you time, Peter Quill. However, I am less certain of the others. 
A wooden one may come around, but I suspect the assassin and the rodent will resist. Mm -hmm. This makes them a dangerous element to our cause. I must eliminate them. Wait! Why? Because <laughs> they're our family, man. Just give them a chance. It's a lot to process. You truly believe they will accept her promise? I, I know it. Take Gamora. Her dad was Thanos. There's gonna be some stuff to work through before she can accept it. And, and Rocket. <laughs> Where to start? He's literally a walking science experiment. What Nikki, uh, the, the, the matriarch, is, is offering, it's, it's all new territory for him. And the wooden one? You said it yourself. You'll come around. I mean, it's Groot, man. He's our rock. Very well, Peter Quill. Good, uh, good. That's 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 great. Um, I'll, I'll let the others know. No, I will fetch her and bring her to you. How? She's like a million light years away. We have already landed on our planet. Think well, Peter Quill. When I return, she will demand your answer. Wait, Drax. We can talk about this. Great. <laughs> 